I didn't think about Admiral at first when we decided to make the change. And I was like, this is going to take forever. And then I thought about it again. I was like, wait, Admiral has fleet commander. I can try to use that. And I breezed through the communities to make those changes. So that alone was just one of the times Admirals definitely saved me. It's a micro tick device. Do whatever you want with it. Remote Winbox is going to back it up. It's going to give you the ability to access it. And you configure it and make it do whatever it is you want to do. And so the, the tool doesn't get in the way of trying to provide a solution to the customer. Getting to, um, getting to, to be able to just copy and paste instead of reprogram by hand from a default state, that was uh, very useful, especially on a device as critical as the, port, as the, as the edge router that's taking all traffic and, and channeling it through your upstream provider. Nothing's, no router on the network is more critical than that one. So it made it quick and painless for me. In the past, we had a lot less microchips, so it was a little bit easier to manage when you had to upgrade them, but you still had to do each one individually. Now that we have thousands of them, doing that individually is nerve wracking. You, you'll spend months trying to get through all of them. With Fleet Command or just through Admiral, you can do that in a brief. You can schedule it overnight. So all you have to do is check the next morning, make sure they all went through and you save yourself hours of being up all night, uh, upgrading firmwares. It's definitely time saver and cost effective too. With Remote Winbox, it doesn't matter. We could have a hundred devices behind a hundred different public IPs and they would all be just as accessible with with no back-end uh, headaches of, of programming. The flexibility to do what you want and replicate what you're doing consistently over all of your routers. We've had other monitoring services that were uh, based on different protocols or uh, not only not centralized towards microchip. So they were good, but they weren't great. And Admiral is great when it comes to managing the microchips.